Hi, welcome back. This morning I'm going to talk to you about hugel culture. Uh, now, hugel culture was uh, originally um, developed in Germany and has been practiced for hundreds of years over in Europe. And generally, hugel culture is used to create fertile soil with good drainage in places where uh, the soil is not so good. Uh, but today I'm going to show you how I make them in my raised beds and I do it in my raised beds because it creates a really good raised bed soil structure. So the way that you create a hugel culture bed is you pile the bottom of the bed with logs. Uh, they can be really any size but I sort of use ones around this size. I also use banana logs like these. And I pile them all in the bottom of the bed and then after I've piled all of those in, I will put a whole lot of sticks and smaller twigs in on top of the logs. And then on top of the logs, I will put another layer of leaf mulch like this. See the leaf mulch? And then on top of the leaf mulch, I'll put, as you can see on this side, there is, um, compost here there is uh, mushroom compost and horse manure this is what I have available locally uh, so nice and fairly hot this one uh, on top of that then I'll put some rich soil and then I will put straw or sugarcane mulch on top of there now the purpose of this layering system is over time all of those parts components will break down they'll create heat they will hold moisture, which is particularly good for us, especially at the moment we're heading into what is predicted to be a really hot summer. So we want our soils to hold and retain as much water as possible. Um, also, while all of this is decomposing, we're releasing nutrients back into the soil, we're uh, encouraging worms, um, fungi, all of those great things to build really good soil and grow really great food. So I hope that you can enjoy making some hugel culture beds at your place and I'd love to know how you go. See ya.